Hey guys, it's Natalie with Cured by Natalie, and instead of my usual Goodwill outlet thrift haul, I decided to change things up and check out the largest Goodwill here in Houston, and it did not disappoint. I found such cool items both to keep for myself as well as to resell on Poshmark, and I am so excited to share what all I found with y'all. One of my favorite finds of the day is this bundle of a succulent and two little cacti. These are so cute. They are ceramic, which I am super thankful for because I cannot keep plants alive for the life of me. And I think these will just make super cute home decor. Let's kick it off with denim because I found such amazing pieces at Goodwill today. First off, my favorite are these vintage 90s light wash full length overalls. They are just amazing. I love overalls, especially vintage ones. These are sized a large. They fit more like a medium slash large and they are the brand American Outpost. I love that they actually have the date that they were made on them. They are made in 1995 just so cool. I love these. I did go ahead and take a try on picture in them because I feel like showing off overalls just does not do them justice. Then I found these Needwell jeans. These are the curvy perfect vintage jean, which is a super recent style. They actually are still for sale online. These are brand new with tag. I have yet to buy and resell Madewell jeans. So I'm super excited to have found this pair that's new with tags along with the same style, the same size in black. These are not new with tags. They look like they've been worn a couple of times, but it's awesome that they're the same size. So it makes them really bundleable if someone is looking for those vintage-esque Madewell jeans. Abercrombie is making a comeback, y'all. I have sold a couple of pair of Abercrombie jeans now. This is the newer Abercrombie & Fitch label. They are so popular on TikTok and Instagram reels and everything. These are the ultra high rise kick flare. They've got a vintage inspired fit and just really cute, really flattering. I know the shorts I'm wearing right now are actually Abercrombie & Fitch, the modern, you know, release. These are a size two and I think they'll move pretty quick. One of my favorite things to see on the rack at a thrift store is this white label. These are some mother jeans. These are the Tomcat style with a raw hem and the coolest rainbow detailing on the back. They are a smaller size. They're a size 23, but I never pass up mother because they'll still sell even though they are such a small, size. It'll just take a little bit longer to move than a more common size. Then sticking in the theme of pants, I did find these Tibby black office work attire pants. Just a nice closet staple pair of black pants. They're a size four and Tibby is one of those brands that you'll find on Netta Porter, which has super high-end sought after brands, which retail for like $500, $600. And then these resell pretty well on list and the real real they're priced at over a hundred. In the men's section, I did find a pretty nice surprise. These are some Lululemon linerless men's shorts. I was really surprised that Goodwill did not mark these up because they do have the label, but it's kind of hidden among this plaid print so they didn't catch it. My Goodwill is super adamant about marking up Lululemon. This is a personal pickup of athletic wear. I love Athleta leggings. I know Athleta leggings don't resell exceptionally well, but I just love the fit and this color is fabulous. So I'm really excited to have these in my personal collection. This Urban Outfitters one shoulder cutout tank totally caught my eye. It is just so fun and funky for summer. I could not pass it up. It is a size medium. Oh, just amazing. Another piece that just caught my eye is this jacquard patchwork corset. It's just awesome. I know it's just fast fashion. I actually found it for sale online for around $45 on some random website. However, just so cool and funky. I am 
obsessed with it. I'll definitely have it listed for sale on Poshmark. It does have a true corset style lace back and it is a size medium. I picked up the perfect pieces for my personal collection. I have been searching for a closet staple black puff sleeve for forever now and I finally found this one. It is from Madewell and it pairs so perfectly with this gingham cotton skirt. It's just so cute. I did take a try on picture so you can see them styled together but I'm super excited to wear these pieces. I found the perfect ribbed cropped long sleeve today. This is from The Gap and I don't know for sure if it's vintage or not but it is just the perfect closet staple piece. I did take a try on in it because I think that it's just amazing. I won't be reselling it. I don't know why I'm so obsessed with it, but I'm really excited for it to get cold so I can be able to wear this. Speaking of items to wear in the cold, I found this deep pile fleece vest. It, this is just so cool. I couldn't pass it up. It's vintage REI, which really doesn't resell that much. I did look up comparison pricing and it's like $20. However, I just thought this was such a fun find. It kind of looks like vintage L.L. Bean or vintage Patagonia, so I just love the vibe that it's giving off. In the boutique area, this Lily Pulitzer wrap flutter sleeve dress totally caught my eye. I love its vibrant print and it even has some little flamingos on there. In my experience, Lily Pulitzer dresses sell extremely well in the summer, so I'm hoping the same is true with this piece, so I didn't mind paying up for it. It is a size large and in like new condition. In the regular dress section, I found a couple of dresses for myself. First off, this H&M plaid puff sleeve dress. I feel like it'll just be so perfect for work in the summer and even in the fall, honestly. Just such a cute closet staple piece. This one's a little bit funkier. I just loved the print and I couldn't leave it behind. It has these birds on it in addition to all the flowers you can probably see on camera. It's a little bit short, but so perfect for the summer here. One last piece I bought for my personal collection is this Gap cotton tiered midi dress. I just think that cotton is such a nice material for summer and this color will carry so well into fall. And really what sealed the deal for me is the fact that it does have pockets. A dress with pockets is a amazing dress to me. You know you're a true thrifter when you can't leave any aisle left unchecked and I found quite a few amazing pieces in the bra section today. First up, this Athleta zip front sports bra. It is pretty much like new. It's a size medium in great condition. Athleta sports bras sell pretty well for me on Poshmark so excited to have found that. Then I found this new to me brand, which is SheFit. Right here, you can kind of see it along the band. This is a high impact zip front sports bra. These bras retail for $75 and they look like they hold their value pretty well on Poshmark. So excited to try out selling this brand SheFit. Also a size medium. This is a brand I love finding and a lot of people kind of pass it up because I don't think they quite know about it yet. This is Buff Bunny and that's what the tag looks like. This is a size medium. It's just a basic strappy sports bra, but their pieces tend to sell pretty quick for me because they're like a collection based brand that only releases a certain amount at a time. So the resale market is pretty good for them. Then this is a brand I've yet to find in the wild and that is Skims. This is a size large, extra large, but I'm really confused because it is tiny. Like, is this a kid size? I really don't know. I need to do some more research on this piece, but I had to pick it up because it is Skims. Then I have a couple of pieces from the swimsuit section. First off, this new with tags, lacy cold shoulder black one piece swimsuit. It's from the brand Adore Me and it is a size 2X. I feel like it's just such a closet staple swimsuit. So in the middle of summer, I feel like swimsuits are moving pretty fast. I'm excited to get this listed in my Poshmark ASAP. Then not technically swimwear, but I did find it in the swimsuit section. 
These are Balance Athletica. I've yet to find this brand in the wild. This is what the short logo looks like. And this is what the tag looks like this little triangle. These are a size small and Balance Athletica retails for around 60 ish and resells really well for around 30. So excited to get these posted because they are in like new condition. My last find of the day is this vintage suit set that I did take a model picture of because I feel like again, holding it up just doesn't do it justice. It's such a cool, vintage piece. I just love the leather detailing along with this plaid print. It is a size 10, but I feel like it fits more like a six slash eight. And I really don't know how to age this tag. I'm going to have to do a little bit more research as to whether it's eighties or nineties or maybe earlier or maybe more modern. So TBD on the age of this vintage piece, but it's so cool. And I do have to go ahead and do a little bit of seamstress work on this button um, because when I was doing the try on photo, this one fell off. But that's all for my haul from the largest Goodwill here in Houston. I hope you enjoyed tuning in and seeing what all I found. Be sure to like this video as well as subscribe to my channel for more fun, thrifty content. Thanks for tuning in. Bye.